Academic activities are yet to resume at the Kumasi Technical University despite the suspension of the industrial action by TUTAC and TUSAC. The National Labour Commission secured a court order compelling the teachers and administrators unions in the technical universities to call off their strike. Correspondent Ibrahim Abubakar visited the campus Thursday morning uh, to gauge the mood. Both TUTAC and TUSAC have called off their strike action in anticipation that government will fulfill its promise of paying them their allowances due them by the close of the month. Here at the Kumasi Technical University, academic activity is yet to resume fully. And as you can see, campus is a bit slow this morning, even though the strike action has been called off. And this is generally because most of the students, we are told, have gone back to their various homes and that they are yet to return on campus. But one thing we've observed is that even though the strike has been called off, lecture halls remain under lock and key. Look, now that the strike has been called off, when are we going to see effective teaching and learning back on campus? We are back in school. Today, communication has been sent to our students who are at home. We are hoping that by close of day, they would be organizing themselves to be back on campus. God willing, tomorrow is their revision day. Fortunately, we are through with teaching. What they are left to do is their examinations, end of first semester examinations. So hopefully, God willing, next week, uh, they would be fully back in school to wind up for their end of semester. Hopefully, go on Monday, the academic board would meet and then come up with the revised timetable for end of first semester examination. And hopefully, same week next week, exams will begin. We know the strike has been called off, but when we went around campus, we observed that the lecture halls are still under lock and key. It wouldn't be all the lecture rooms, but the dedicated lecture rooms that we usually use for examinations. And once we are closing in and preparing for exam, usually they close those designated lecture halls. So the place will be made ready for exam next week. If you are a student of the Commerce Technical University, any other technical university, be back in school for full academic work to resume. We will sacrifice and make sure we catch up with the time spent in the industrial struggle. We are calling off the strike with the understanding that the amounts going to be paid by government end of January will not fall short of the rates that are being paid to our colleagues in the other universities. That was Dr. Smart Sapon. He's the um, TUTAC president here at the Kumasi Technical University. Well, you heard him, he's saying that they will put in all their effort to ensure that they catch up with the lost period. And he is also urging government to not to fail on its promise of paying them allowances due them by the close of the month. Ibrahim Abubakar, TV3, Kumasi.